is stuck to the ground. Oh my God. <laughs> It's really a two-way play. It's called Tom and Jerry. Um, I think Pat said we'll let y'all figure out who's who. Um, but as Tom and Jerry kind of what we did in Philly game, the uh, corn dog play, it's kind of a similar concept. And um, when I seen the corner back up, I knew I was going to get the ball, caught the, caught the football, and I blacked out. I ain't going to lie, I blacked out. <laughs> and um, I seen Pat running towards me, man. I'm like, oh, we just won. Like, okay, I understand now. And, um, and after that, it's, the rest is history. Man, roller coaster, man. I mean, it's a lot of ups and downs. Um, going through a lot, you know, uh, especially with the injury. You know, trying to start over with a new team and didn't really play. And KC welcoming back with open arms. And now to get here to the Super Bowl and the end, how it ended, I think it, I don't think I want to know other way. What a defense makes it for the 49ers taking first. Do you guys have confidence that, that they can go out there and, and do what you're going to do? Yeah, I thought that was going to defer. I thought that was the right thing to do was defer. But, um, when they took the ball, we like, oh yeah, bet. Like now we know what we gotta do as an offense. It's like it's it's kind of one of them things. They kick the field goal. We you know we look at each other. Like, oh yeah, let's go score. It's, it's time to go score and um and, and let's go win this game. So that's kind of was our mindset the whole way and um and we walked it off. You've been around Pat for a long time. I have. Oh, how how much confidence is there in the world? Whatever that is, that's what we that's what we have in him because I mean, <laughs> the man has done it time and time again, man. I think he improved himself in those situations that he's so calm under pressure and he make the right decisions. He know what to do, um, even when he's running with his feet or scrambling and making a throw or you know telling the coach to, to call the right call. I mean, he he's one of the best I've ever seen in those pressure moments like that, and I don't, I wouldn't rather have nobody else in those type of moments. So when you quiet the phone, you didn't know the game was over. I, well, I knew, but like when you black out, it's like. And then and you just come back to reality, you know, and I think it was one of those moments where I, I just, it, it just, I blanked and, and it snapped me like, oh, like we won it, you know, and um, and we just went from there. How about the long pass you had in the first half? Yeah, I remember that pass. I, I, I forgot I even did that. <laughs> um, but yeah, that was a play that we've been, uh, we've been, we had in and um, Power told me it was going to be an airtime throw and he was throwing it no matter what. <laughs> so um, when I, when I seen it, you know, he, um, Obviously, like a, a corner post in, in a sense. And when I was running, as you can see, I seen him throw it. I'm like, oh, let me dig some more because I know he's going to throw this thing far. And um, all I seen was him throw it, and I seen the corner was rushing back. And I was like, dang, like, he might try to pick this. And for some reason, I guess he just lost it and I just made a good catch and, um, you know, wanted to, uh, to get that out the way. Hopefully, we could have scored on that drive. But, you know, either way, either way it go. Is it time to go with this win? Is he the GOAT? I don't know, man. He, he's he's there. You know, when you talk about goats, you gotta think Tom got seven of them things, man. <laughs> That's kind of hard to, you know, you know. But Pat's still young, and for him to be even that conversation is a, is a testament to itself. And I, I see the guy work. He worked very hard and in, in, in improving his game, you know, you know, day in day out. Um, every season you see he get better at something, you know. And um, but for him to be in that goat conversation, it tells you the testament of how good he really is, you know. So. Uh, Mill, my girl might cook, you know, I don't know what she's going to cook. I'll make her cook something, though. Uh, maybe lasagna or something like that. And the song? Oh, man. I don't know. I don't know if y'all ever heard my brother named Show Out, though. Um, my brother named Show Out, 2 WCTs. He got a song called Back Focus. And that song right there, man, I listen to that song every day. And that kind of song is like, you know, you give me a chance, I'm, I'm going to make something kind of happen type thing. So this, the thing with it. So um, that's the song I'm going to listen to for sure. Appreciate it. Thank you. Can I take this Gatorade?